Putin's brutality knows no limits. One day, we were all appalled as a maternity clinic got bombed. The next, when mass graves were discovered in Bucha. But colleagues, how far does one in humanity go if you applaud military units that are linked to mass rape? The reports of sexual violence and rapes by Russian forces continue to grow, and so do the number of pregnancies. Many Ukraine women and girls are traumatized as they witnessed how their cities were attacked and their beloved family were killed. And if one trauma wasn't enough, rape survivors are now trying to cope with the idea that inside they are carrying the baby of those that erased all that they loved. Faced with these horrors, colleagues, the EU cannot be a silent bystander. That is why today we call on the European Commission to step up and act without delay to ensure that dignity health kits and emergency contraceptives reach Ukraine and host countries. To ensure, very important colleagues, access to safe abortion care throughout the whole EU for pregnant women victim of rape. And to ensure justice for the war crimes committed against women. These women already lost so much. We must not disappoint the ones counting on our help. And remember, women here, maybe also the men, eh? what Madeleine Elbright said, there is a special place in hell for women who don't help other women. Thank you very much.